Subtyping plays a huge role when using polymorphism. Here is a list of shapes. I want to iterate the list and call the draw method on each shape. But for this I have to make sure that each shape indeed has a draw method. And in this video you learn how to do this with nominal and structural subtyping. With all the new static type checking possibilities in Python, it is easy to forget that Python does not need explicit types at all. Let me show you some runtime type checking. Here are classes circle and rectangle. Both have a draw method. I create a function to draw all shapes. And call it with a list with two shapes. And that works. But now I will break something on purpose. Python gives an attribute error. The attribute error is technically correct, but it does not explain why it went wrong. The proposed solution to use draw2 steers me in the wrong direction. I want Python to tell me I need to implement the proper draw method in the rectangle class. To get better runtime information, I will use an abstract base class and inherit circle and rectangle from it. I inherit circle from shape and rectangle and try again. By using the abstract base class, Python was able to give me a much more descriptive error message at runtime. And it gets better. I will run static type checker mypy. Look at this message. MyPy was able to spot the error even before running the code. Python inherited circle from shape. And it did this by explicitly targeting the base class name between the round brackets. This is known as nominal subtyping. And here is some information for non-English speakers. A noun represents a thing. And nominal is the adjective form of noun, in this case meaning so much as circle being of type of shape. We also say that circle is a shape. This is an inheritance relationship shown in UML with the open arrow. Now you saw that the static type checker was able to spot the error when using nominal subtyping. Notice the abstract base class does not implement the draw method. It serves as an interface. Inherited classes must implement a custom draw method. As long as the shape class only serves as an interface, there is an alternative that does not require inheritance. Let me show you. I first break the inheritance connection. Then I turn the abstract base class into a protocol class. I remove the decorator and import protocol from typing. Notice the error is still in my code. I run mypy again. That is interesting. Why was the type checker not able to spot the error? This code will crash if I run it. The reason the static type checker was not able to spot the error is because there is no link between the protocol class and the shapes. So I make this connection by annotating the list. I check with mypy. And now the type checker was able to make the connection between the shape protocol and the shape instances. The error message is not great, by the way. Let me try another type checker. Yes, this one tells me exactly what to do to fix the problem. And the error is gone. 
The program will work. It does. Notice that class circle and rectangle do not inherit from shape and still they are considered type compatible with it because they implement the draw function with the same signature. The subtyping relationship was not nominal but structural. Since the circle and rectangle class do not inherit from an abstract base class anymore, the runtime checks will also not work anymore. Structural typing can be checked with static type checkers. In Python, structural subtyping is also known as static duct typing. And to learn more about duct typing, click on the screen right now and we'll see each other in the next video.